Hey folks, Justin Thayer, TeamThayer.com. Today, I'm going to talk about my favorite subject, marketing. Marketing is my favorite subject when it comes to real estate sales simply because it's the most important part of real estate sales. First thing you got to do before you can sell anything is get eyes on the product. The biggest piece of marketing in today's market is internet. When it comes to internet, there's a lot of things one can focus on, there's a lot going on, but what we're going to discuss today is the two top real estate search and information websites in the world today. And that is going to be Zillow, Trulia, so Zillow.com and Trulia.com. So I have a list pulled up here. This is the top 15 real estate websites in the world uh, per page view, per visitor. Uh, Zillow uh, has a tremendous uh, market share with 36 million visitors monthly. And then Trulia comes in second with 23 million visitors monthly. So starting with Zillow. Very important to have a great profile page, okay? Uh, and we'll take a look at that a little closer. This is our profile page on Zillow. A um, little blue ribbon here basically says I'm a Zillow all-star because I have a knowledge in all the realms of information when it comes to Lane County real estate. You go a little lower, you have a map that shows my current listings as well as uh, recent past listings, so actives and past solds. Um, you've got a spot for a video here. I usually have some type of a home walkthrough video. On down to my individual reviews. So more important than what my profile page looks like by far is going to be how quickly or how often my listings show up on the front page of the search. Here we are on the search page of Zillow. So Zillow automatically takes the information from the multiple listing service or the RMLS, which is here. I absolutely take advantage of the automatic upload because it's all done for me. So all my pictures and all my text is going to be in Zillow. The difference between what I'm doing and I'd say what probably 90% of the rest of the world is doing is I come back to the Zillow website after it's uploaded and I manipulate the content as much as I can based on the research I've done to make the most important things stand out. When a certain set of parameters are put in, the algorithm takes a look at it, gathers all the information, and chooses which listings are the most important, which ones are going to go on the front page. So we're just going to test this real quick, and we're going to see how fast I'm going to get this listing, this is one I've already manipulated, to come up. Okay, here's my first search test. So I'm going to go to 97404. I'm going to put in... 150, $200,000, and I'm going to make sure it hit my search, and then I'm going to kind of scroll down here on the sidebar to see if I pop up first page, and there I am. Click on it. Perfect. So come up right in the middle of the page. Beautiful looking listing, great picture. That is the result of manipulating the algorithm. Here we are on Trulia, and as far as the search in, in the profile goes, it's pretty much the same kind of website. It doesn't give you uh, values such as Zillow does, but Trulia 
uh, is the same outside that. You've got the same looking profile page for me. That's our Team Thayer profile page. Uh, you've got my recommendations, people recommending me, or reviewing me, uh, my listings, questions, technical questions I've answered for other people who have asked me on Trulia there. We're going to get right to the search. So once again, we're going to do a flat search with no bedrooms, no bathrooms, no square footage, no lot size, no parameters except for a zip code and a price range. So let's see if we can come up first page with a zip code and a price range once again. So we're going to 97404. We're going to put in a price range. We'll put in the same price range, 150 to 200. 150 to 200 and hopefully I'll hit right about the middle of the page and there I am good looking picture nice green grass beautiful paint color gosh that looks great let's click on it there you go a little bit different on what you can do as far as plugins um, you can do actually a little more information on the pictures on Trulia, but that's something that it, being a broker or a professional, you just have to study. That's it. See you next time.